So the uh, threat of wildfires hangs over most of Southern California still today, a day after those strong Santa Ana winds turned deadly. Yeah, and CBS 2's Cara Finstrom is live in Tustin, where a woman was killed by a falling tree. Cara? Yeah, Sharon, you also mentioned uh, that uh, red flag warning, the concern for wildfires. Humidity levels here very low, and those winds expected to pick up again after daybreak. The good news, though, not as powerful as they were yesterday. So take a look behind us. You can see, though, the devastation that was called deadly destruction yesterday. Powerful gusts here caused that massive eucalyptus tree to come crashing down on a car, killing the woman inside. Dennett Burmas was 34 years old. She was leaving her apartment carport when... Everything changed in an instant. She was pinned inside. Emergency crews tried to help. By the time they got to her in the driver's seat, she had died. We just spoke with a man who lives on the next block. He saw the rush of first responders. He's still shaken by the randomness of her death. Sad part about it, a minute before or a minute after or maybe even sooner than that, she would have been safe, you know? I mean, who would have thought? Killed by the wind. Winds howled all across the Southland yesterday. This is video of a tree that came crashing down on a home in La Crescenta. This is at Janet Lee Drive and Briggs Avenue. There were people inside at the time. Fortunately, nobody was hurt there. Back here live, you can see that section of the carport is red tagged where the eucalyptus came crashing down. Neighbors have been pulling their cars out further down. Uh, Jeff and Sharon, they tell us they are rattled too. Uh, they tell us the woman's husband uh, is grieving her this morning. Uh, she is survived by him. So just a sad situation out here this morning.